The final episode has been released, and we have two more weeks till the game is released. So, let's take a look at the final episode of Dark Beginnings. Team Dark infiltrates a gun base and are about to get Shadow a shuttle for the Ark, when suddenly the heavy dog mech appears and attacks them. Shadow and Omega are able to take it down and secure the shuttle for a launch. However, emergency protocols activate and almost shoot the rocket down, but thankfully the gun commander intervenes and lets Shadow go. Rouge and Abe have a great conversation about Shadow being a lone wolf, or lone hedgehog, I guess? Oh, brother, this guy stinks! And we finish this episode with Rouge revealing the Time Eater files that Eggman had, and Shadow having flashbacks with Maria that never happened. Shadow remains focused, however, and continues his mission headstrong. Man, each episode really has a dedicated sad moment, doesn't it? For episode 1, it was the Aurora Borealis scene. Episode 2 was Maria comforting Shadow about being part alien. And this one is just the ending itself. The music, the false memories, Shadow almost breaking down. It's all compelling, but really sad stuff, and I love it. This series' characterization of Shadow has been nothing short of fantastic, in my opinion. He's reserved and quiet, but he still has a good heart, and at the end of the day, wants to do the right thing. I wish we got to see him being a gun agent again, but hey, maybe they'll set that up in Shadow Generations itself. Only time will tell. I also really liked how the gun commander was handled here. He's still a hardened soldier, but he has warmed up to Shadow and sees the good in him. A great contrast from when he was a kid who was terrified of him. I hope to see this character again real soon. Also, Omega and Rouge are great as usual. Omega once again calling Dibs is still the best line of dialogue in the series. So, my overall thoughts on this miniseries are as follows. The story was straightforward and had many great moments, such as all the flashbacks with Maria, the fight scenes, and Team Dark working together again. The series left me feeling pretty satisfied with the final product, and the ending song almost made me shed a tear. They need such a good song for this series, man. I do wish the episodes were longer than 4-6 to six minutes and that we had a scene with Black Doom, but overall, I enjoyed the series and I strongly recommend it. This series did its job well and keeps me excited for the release of the game. The trailers already had me excited with all the Doom powers and returning boss fights, but this did just as good a job as keeping me... But this did just a good... But this did just as good of a job as keep. <sighs> but this did just as good of a job at keeping me hyped. I'll also try to put a review out for the game whenever I can, in case you were wondering. That's all I have to say. I hope you enjoyed it. Have a good whatever time it is, and see you later. Okay, hold on, wait a minute. All good, just a week ago. Poop at my house, and we party every weekend. So on the radio, that's my favorite song. Make me bounce around like I don't.